All right, Jerry, with a uh, essentially a no comment there today, and Edward Egros was at uh, AT&T <laughs> Stadium for that big announcement. I think Jerry's just relieved that it's not his club being ripped. For I, I once. think that's safe to say. Still kind of played it close to the vest in terms of uh, you know making sure he's not you know throwing another owner under the bus. All right, let's look at some of the uh, the text messages. Tom Brady did not hand over his phone records, but the equipment guys did. Locker room attendants McNally and uh, Yastrzemski apparently did the dirty work. We'll read these. I'll be McNally. You be Yastrzemski. I'm ready. From October 17th, after Brady had supposedly complained about overly inflated footballs, McNally. Tom Socks, I'm going to make that next ball a blanking balloon. I checked some of the balls this morn. The refs bleeped us. A few of them were at almost 16. That's pounds per square inch. The league minimum is 12 and a half. They didn't recheck them after they put air in them. F Tom, 16 is nothing. Wait till next Sunday. This is our uh, Boston accent. Uh, October 21st, McNally, make sure you blow up the ball to look like a rugby ball so Tom can get used to it before Sunday. Then October 23rd, McNally, again, blanking Tom, make sure the pump is attached to the needle. Boy, these guys are potty mouths. Uh, watermelons are coming. So, so angry. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> McNally says the only thing deflating is his passer rating. A little humor there. Then October 24th, McNally, Wanting something in return from Brady for the work he's done to deflate the football, as McNally says, better be surrounded by cash and new kicks or it's a rugby ball on Sunday. So uh, not a lot of love for Tom Brady there. The punishment phase comes later now. I think Brady should get a couple of games of suspension. What do you think? Something needs to happen. It, it, it all depends upon how much Brady knew about the situation. He may have lied publicly. He didn't help. The, he didn't cooperate with the investigation whatsoever. So in my mind, something needs to happen, even if it's a significant fine and no games, still something. And Belichick, who, who invented modern day pro football and, and knows everything that's going on in his franchise, we're supposed to believe I had no idea this was going on. The, the yeah. same coach with Spygate. They'll lose, the, the same guy. They'll lose some draft picks over this, and I think, again, I think Brady will be suspended a couple of games. We'll see. Mm -hmm. That's it. I'm Mike, Fox 4 Sports.